Tani got left on a train again the other day. Well, it's now 22.17. No one's come to get me off. They got me on absolutely fine at Leeds. Staff knew I was on and I'm now crawling off the train. I've been left on trains a lot too. I have complaint letters going back decades and I have over a dozen examples on my YouTube channel. I had a feeling they wouldn't turn up. <laughs> I've never known them turn up. I've never known them turn up. Hello, mate. Sorry, I didn't know you were there, pal. Uh, Sorry, mate. You went for someone to get you off? Yeah. What the hell, Josh? What have we been doing this? Sorry. It's alright. I didn't know. I'll see if you win. Right. Oh, just one second, mate. My colleague's memory isn't as good as it used to be. Yeah, he forgot me. Um, Level access guide, not at Abbey Road, we need a ramp. Yeah, nobody turned up with a ramp. This is when they don't turn up with a ramp. Excuse me. It should be coming with a ramp, but I don't know where they are. I guess it's someone. I'm a wheelchair user, I'm coming off at Newcastle, but assistance haven't turned up. Excuse me! Hey! The ramp, please! Many apologies. Okay. I've just missed my last bus home. Can't be helped. Actually, it can be helped. It should be eradicated. Disgraceful, unacceptable. I'm glad she spoke out because I know that for that one example, there are many, many other examples where people with disabilities have not been able to access transport um, or other facilities, frankly. We've got to stop that. You shouldn't be able to carry people from place to place if you haven't got the facilities to ensure everybody can get safely on and off the train or plane or whatever it may be.